A little boy is recovering from second degree burns after running through a burning home to alert his grandmother. The fire happened early last Thursday morning in a single family home in the 6000 block of Southwest Lane in Platteville. The homeowner says things could have been much worse if it weren't for the boy's heroic actions. Our Keely Arthur has this story all new at 10. These charred walls tell the story of a terrible house fire Thursday night. The story they don't share is how a little boy became a young man that same day. The first thing I saw was the fire. It's a scene most 10 year olds would cower from, but one Tony Rue faced head on when he was woken up by his grandmother around 5 a.m. She yelled, Tony, get up, and then she started calling for my dad. He sprung out of bed to get his father from upstairs, but was blocked by flames. Oh, oh, my feet! My feet! In this surveillance video, you can hear him as his feet touch the fire. I stepped to the fire, help me. Tony pushed through the pain, reaching the second floor, all to find his father, thankfully, wasn't home. Dad! He then orders his dad's Amazon Echo to get help. Alexa! Call 911. I'm sorry, I can't help. And apparently it can't do that. So I ran back downstairs and Grandma's dumping a bowl of water onto the fire. Yeah. I told her we have to get out. Because her face was all gray and everything. After that, Tony runs to the neighbors who were able to reach officers and lead the grandmother to safety. His family crediting him with getting her out before it was too late. She would have been lost. Yeah. Ask the 10 year old if he did anything special that day, and he'll tell you this. These things happen to everybody. Well, not to everybody, but they happen a lot. Talk to his father, though, and he understands the full magnitude of what his son did. He's definitely here on my eyes. Now the family says the house is completely gone, but they hope to rebuild on it very soon. In Platteville, Keely Arthur, WISC News 3. Nice to see that little boy yeah. smiling. If you would like to help the family, please go to our website, channel3000.com. Wow, an incredible story.